Hello everyone. Today I'll be showing you how you can ship a document using Terminal Africa. So first thing you want to do is, as usual, log into your Terminal account and from the dashboard you can either select Arrange Delivery from here or select the Shipping tab and um, click Arrange Shipment right here and so the first thing you want to do is provide your pickup address so the information of the person that is sending which is presumably yourself um, you can find your address here if it's something you've done before then your address should automatically um, already be showing here but what you can do is just type in your address and it should pop up right here so um, fill in all the other details as well the name your email your phone number um, state country city postal code and click next then the next information you want to put in is the delivery address so where that um, package will be delivered to and just in the same way you type in the address um, and it should also be registered as well you also want to put in the name of the person receiving the package and you know their phone number and also their email address once that's done you can also proceed to the next step which is now in, um, including the information about the item being shipped now since you're shipping a document this is where it will vary from where you're shipping a parcel um, first you want to add the item um, so let's just say you're shipping a passport you can put that here and then you want to describe the item you have to describe it properly um, and include enough words to your um, description if not it will not be accepted um, let's just say Nigerian International Passport brand new and then here is where you make the change from parcel to document and you also you know include the quantity if it's one or two and any weight as well um, and any value of whatever it is you are shipping once that is done you select the currency that you wish to pay in and also the kind of packaging that you're using so since it's a document most likely you just be using an envelope and yeah now you'd retrieve your shipping rates from various carriers um it might take a few seconds but yes once you see your rate you can compare who you want to use so as you can see dhl it's three thousand fedex nearly four and then you also have DHL with insurance, which is about 6K. So whichever one you choose, um, that just um, you know takes you to the confirmation page where you can review all the information you've put in so far, uh, make sure it's all correct, and then you know you can pay either from your terminal wallet. As you can see, I don't have enough funds, so I cannot do that. Or you can pay from paystack or flutter wave and once you do that um you know the shipment will automatically be confirmed um, i can show you a bit of how that would go so you can enter your card number you can enter your bank you can use ussd um, and once you make this payment the shipment will be arranged and you know the courier will be on their way to you to pick up so that's it